How many times have I told you, don't touch my stuff? Well, I'm sorry, but there was a dirty great big pile of wash in there and I just had an uncontrollable urge to stick them in the machine. Well, I can do my own. And then my socks run oh. a bit. But pink's all right for, for you, isn't it? Well, this is new, this. Well, I'll get some colour restorer thingy from Viv. Yeah, whatever. Let me get a sense of humour restorer for you. You got an hangover? No. Then you've had a fallout with Jackson again? Like I'm that predictable. I'm sorry to break it to you. Go on, what have you done this time? It's not me, it's him. Found out that he paid off that dog murderer. Jackson? Jackson? Yes, Jackson. Handed over cash to that muppet. Basically paid him for killing Clyde. No, well, it, it might seem like that to you. I told him that I'd sort it. Well, that's probably why. He decided to spare you the kicking. Well, like I couldn't take him myself. Yeah, and then you'd have ended up in hospital, but now you won't because he cares enough to save your backside. Well, he shouldn't have bothered. You want to learn some gratitude, you? That lad thinks the flipping world of you. Yeah, I know. I just lost it. I didn't mean to. Well, tell him that, not me. You can't avoid me forever. What well, about? Something's bothering you. And before you start, us mums know these things without being told. You reckon? I saw you slumped over your pint and I said to myself, I said, Hazel, that is the face of a boy who's been dumped. Am I right? Wrong. Then why have you got a face like a slapped backside? Because we kind of fell out. <laughs> so what's new? Well, this time I said something you didn't really want to hear. I'm still waiting. I've never told him I loved him ever. You didn't. You don't. Why else would I still be here? So I told him and he couldn't run any quicker if I was carrying a bloodstained machete. Hiya. You all right? Do you want a drink? Nothing. Great. <clears throat> <laughs> girls' night out, eh? Well, less of the girls, more of the kind of whoever fancies getting absolutely trallied. Do you ever do anything else? Yeah, I do. Not that you'd want to hear about it. Who's up for it? <laughs> Count me in. Uh, no, thanks. I, uh, I promised Betty I'd help her with her self-portrait. Get to take a photo? I would. Nice try, but no. What about you? No, I'm seeing Adam. See you later. Vibes or what? I'll pass on tonight as well, thanks. Oh, you've not had another argument, eh? Something about nothing. They'll sort it out. I wish. He's blaming himself for coming on a bit strong. Mum. What, to Aaron? He said the L word. Thanks. What, you love my Aaron? Yeah, he didn't love me. It's great how things work out, innit? Come on, shift. Shift, please. It was my own fault, really. I should have just said no when she had oh, time. What do you think? Not bad for a farm boy who goes shopping with his mum. Yeah, well, if you ask Jackson nicely, he might be able to buy you some. Not asking Jackson anything. <sighs> Go on, what's he done now? Nothing much. What, nothing, nothing? He just came over all serious. Oh. How serious? As it gets. About you? No, about Paddy. And, uh, did you get serious back? No, I just kind of went off on one. I mean, we were having a laugh, yeah, and then he has to go and say that. Why couldn't he have just kept his mouth shut? Paddy, how's it going? Peachy, how do you think? Good. 